Hey, what's up guys? I'm live. I finally got some good internet connection now so I can share this nuggets, these va this value, these gems with you. And the topic of today is don't bite more than you can chew, right? Because I remember when I was working at my security guard job and I was thinking about the goals I was trying to accomplish. And I was thinking about the vision that I had for myself and how I wanted to change circumstances, not only for myself, but also change things for my family's life. And Sometimes when you have these thing, these big dreams and these big aspirations and these visions that you have for yourself, sometimes we can get a little overwhelmed, right? Or a little discouraged because it just seems like what we're trying to accomplish is way too big, right? And that can sometimes take us off course from what we're trying to accomplish. So the easiest way to get to your goals is to, instead of thinking of the big picture all the time and always thinking about the ultimate objective of what you're trying to accomplish, Break down your vision into small little steps, right? So don't bite off more than you can chew. Don't have this vision of this, have this dream, this big dream, right? And because it's so big and it's something where it may be a, a big, large income, right? It may be something that's going to take, you know, work for you to accomplish. Don't think of the ultimate goal, right? Don't think of the ultimate vision because what happens is sometimes we think about what it's going to take to get there and it discourages us. So the easiest way to get to your whatever the dreams are, the dreams is that you have or the visions that you have, the easiest way to get there is to break down your big vision into small little pieces, right? And an easy way to do that is instead of having like yearly goals, you can have even daily goals and weekly goals, right? That, that's a way that I stay on track is I always like to break down my goals into like daily goals or into weekly goals. For example, I'll give you another example of me doing that. Uh, when I went to when I said I want to make fifteen thousand dollars a month, right? I broke it down to a daily goal, right? Fifteen thousand dollars a month is five hundred dollars a day in profit, right? Fifteen thousand dollars a month might sound like a big, huge goal. Like, damn, how the hell am I gonna hit that, right? Like, that's gonna take a lot of work. But when I break it down to just five hundred dollars a day instead of the big fifteen thousand dollars a month, that's much more easier for me to attain, right? That's much more doable right i can see that happening for myself because it's just five hundred dollars profit so i know if i could focus on five hundred dollars profit i could get to the fifteen thousand dollars a month so that's a prime example of me breaking down the big vision and the big dream and the big goal into a smaller vision a smaller goal that's attainable another way that i was able to do that early on in my career and i still do it right i still use the same principle to be able to accomplish big goals because i'm focusing on the small steps in between instead of the big goal that i'm trying to accomplish and another way that i was able to do that is i knew that i wanted to generate a certain amount of sales every single month in my business, right? So instead of looking at it as, oh, I wanna generate 50 to 60 sales a month, right? I started looking at my business as, how can I get two sales per day, right? How can I get two sales per day? So instead of me looking at the monthly goal, right? I started to, I was able to focus on the daily goal, which I knew once I hit the daily goal, that's me hitting the monthly goal, right? So that's one of the easiest ways I could tell you to stay focused and stay ambitious and to stay motivated it's not to not always don't always stay focused on the big objective you're trying to accomplish don't always try to stay focused on the big dream lifestyle the big vision that you're trying to accomplish focus on the little mini steps and the little action that you got to take on a smaller level to eventually get to that greater goal right and that's going to allow you to stay on top of your game that's going to allow you to stay on track um, another way of me doing this is the same way how i said i focus on two sales a day to be able to generate 50 to 60 sales a month is I then broke it down. Okay, well, how many leads do I need to get to get to two sales a day? And it's funny that I'm talking about all of these nuggets today because I really, really, really broke down some of these concepts on the uh, call that I recorded in the Rich Talk, right? I just uploaded a new a new call today in the Mega Duplication System back office, uh, which is about an hour long, right? I recorded a call where I tell you exactly how step by step how I was able to quit my my job right how I was able to do it within just 365 days which is a year right I was able to do it and I tell you on that call exactly how I did it so if you do want to get access to that information you can get that call it's just a one time fee of just seven dollars and you have that audio for life to listen to uh, what's up Antonio how's it going brother I hope you're enjoying your Sunday today man I see you said facts I know man I try to try to keep it real man you got to speak the truth you got to speak the message to the world and let people receive it because that's how you share value and make income brother but yeah guys like I was saying like don't focus on this big major goal right break it down into smaller attainable goals um, 
I do have weekly goals as well as monthly goals and I'll even sometimes break it down to a daily goal, right? I get that specific to a daily goal because I know if I accomplish my daily goals, I'm going to accomplish my weekly goals, right? And if I accomplish my weekly goals, I know I'm going to accomplish my monthly goals. And if I accomplish my monthly goals, I know I'm going to accomplish, it's inevitable that I'm going to accomplish my yearly goals, right? So that's the easiest way to accomplish and hit off your goals, whatever it is you're trying to attain. Same thing with my business, right? I don't get all confused and overwhelmed with a thousand different strategies. I stay focused on a strategy at a time and I take action on that strategy, right? Because it's easy to get overwhelmed. There's like hundreds of strategies, thousands of strategies out there on the web. But if I try to do all of them at one time, I'm going to get overwhelmed. I'm just going to give up on my business, right? I'm not going to take it seriously. But if I focus on one strategy, now it's more likely that I'm going to master that one strategy if I only focus on that. But if I'm, if I'm focusing on 10 different strategies at one time, how can I expect to master anything to get the results that I want? I can't, right? I'm going to get overwhelmed. I'm going to get discouraged and I'm going to give up. So another easy way to get more results in your business is to even break down the strategies and keep your focus as limited as possible, right? Which means if you're trying to master this strategy, focus on that for a long enough time to see results happen from that before you move on to the next strategy, right? That's the best for more subscribers from your training, got more subscribers from your training, for real, for real. This is awesome, man. I'm happy you're getting results, Antonio. That's because you're an action taker, bro. You deserve the subscribers, you deserve the leads, and eventually you'll be getting sales, bro. You deserve it, man. You deserve it. I respect your, your ambition and your hustle, man. But yeah, like I was saying, break down your big goals into smaller goals that you can achieve. And that's how you'll get to your ultimate goals much, 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 much faster. Much, much faster. Instead of vo focusing on this big ass gigantic goal, this big dream, yes, it's possible for you. Yes, you can win. Yes, I'm telling you from personal experience, I've seen how much my life changed, so I know it's possible for you, but it's gonna be easier if you do the opposite to what I did. What I did when I first got started was the wrong thing. I got overwhelmed by my big goal. I got overwhelmed by my vision. It wasn't until I learned how to break down my goal, my big goal into smaller goals and my big vision into smaller visions, that's when I started to achieve the success that I want to achieve, guys. That's when I started to have success. Because when we're trying to focus on a million different things at one time, it is very easy to get confused. It's very hard to stay focused. You're not clear on your goals. You're not clear on your visions. But if you piece everything into smaller attainable information and smaller attainable action steps that you can take, then that's when you start seeing your, your dreams coming true and things changing in your business, things changing in your life. But I don't want you to get overwhelmed by your big vision. Your big vision is very possible, but break it down into smaller steps and you'll see your bigger vision come true faster than ever before, guys. So if you got value from this video, make sure you drop in the comments what you learned from this video. Uh, you know, this is a very, very powerful video. Uh, if I was watching this when I first got started, I'd be light years ahead, right? Light years ahead. I wouldn't have deal dealt with a lot of the struggles that I had to deal with early on in my career. And since this is a business of, you know, where we, we, we learn something and then we could teach other people in this business, that's why it's such an awesome industry because everybody's teaching everybody, everybody's growing at a different pace, but at the end of the day, everybody's growing, everybody's developing their mindset, everybody's developing their skill sets, everybody's getting better and better at creating their own income, becoming more and more free, right? Which is the whole vision of the 300 to Freedom Movement is to let you know that you can become free making your passion into a paycheck, right? Living a purposeful life, a life of purpose, doing what you want, when you want, making money, impacting the world, inspiring the world, motivating the world. That's what this is truly, truly, truly about. So for those of you who don't know what the movement is about and what the message is and what we stand for, I just gave you all the information you needed as far as that. Uh, let me see, is there anything I'm missing? Like I said, get access to that audio if you wanna learn how I quit my job within just 365 days. Um, some more announcements. Uh, yes, Wednesday, this Wednesday, we will have the 300 to Freedom conference call as well. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. Hope you guys have a happy and lovely Sunday. Make it a productive one. Spend time with the family. Do what you got to do. I'll see you guys in the next video. John Belcher, peace.